police are searching for the driver who intentionally rammed a Detroit police cruiser and then took off on foot. The whole thing was caught on camera as well. This happened at the Sitco on 8 Mile near Glastonbury last night with officers opening fire to try and get that driver to stop. Let's bring in Sean Lay tonight. Uh, and Sean, there were two other people in that SUV who took off and look we found other video this is a green light gas station police have that video we have other video of this incident i want to show you it is absolutely wild because the suspected carjacker here so desperate to get away from police he would ram police officers even try to run them over in an effort to get away take a look at this Had that driver side door open up that GMC, you call. All right, vehicle was taken off. Through the video obtained by Local 4 and the play-by-play -play on the radio by Detroit police officers. Eastbound between the houses. Yeah, two cars on foot in the area of 20234 Foss. Two males on foot. We can walk you through this dangerous incident at the Sitco on 8 Mile at Glastonbury. Just before midnight last night, a white SUV pulls into the gas station lot. Police said that SUV had been carjacked. Police were following closely behind. The moment police attempt to box the SUV in, the driver takes off, hitting one police car in front of it. Then the SUV nearly tips over, driving over the hood of the police car behind it. Three DPD officers in danger danger of being run over fire shots at that vehicle. There's a call to see if any officers were hurt. 2400 radio, that's a negative on injuries for DPD. Tonight, DPD tells us it's unclear if their shots hit any of the three people inside the SUV all got out and ran. However, as you can hear, someone in that SUV was leaving behind a trail of blood. There is uh, some blood drops um, in the door and on the on the uh, inside the door. Two suspects were caught. The driver still on the run. Police back in the area today searching. In fact, police still out in this area right now looking for that alleged carjacking, the driver uh, of that carjacked car. And he may either be the one who was shot or at least hit by flying glass. Karen Jason. Wow, just amazing. And this all stemmed yep. from that carjacking, Sean? And that was earlier in the day. So last night, an undercover DPD officer saw the particular SUV, the white one that had been carjacked and followed him right in here. You saw what happened next. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, Sean, we appreciate it.